go to rajahollowayhomes.com. Hey guys, I'm on location at the amazing Baxter Village. There you have a beautiful little portico with benches, a pocket park backed up to some of the beautiful uh, saucy Burbank, probably, homes here that were built, what, 10, 15 years ago. Now we have some new construction townhomes from DRB Homes. Now we never thought we were gonna see this. They're called Baxter Village Towns. And if you give me a call, uh, I would love to get you in to see one. But what we're gonna do in the absence of that, while I'm waiting for your call, is take a look at one that's for sale in the 380s somewhere. This unit right here, for a quick move, maybe you're trying to get into Fort Mill schools for the coming school year, that's the one to beat. And uh, wow, look at that. Look at that. Three stories of just abundant living. So here we go, we're coming in. Now they are building a total of 20 here. As you can see, they're moving dirt. Got some units up there on the hill. And uh, there's still time. And DRB is uh, basically Dan Ryan Builders. When they came into the market, uh, they were associated with fielding homes uh, when DRB's uh, parent company, so you've got a full bath with a shower on the main level. So that could be multi-generational because you have a bedroom right here on the main level. Now maybe that's your work from home space. Maybe not, but you've got light coming in and it is lovely. So when Sumitomo Forestry purchased Crescent Communities, which owned fielding homes, they already had real estate here in Fort Mill at Mason's Bend and also, wow, this is neat. Paddler's Cove was part of that. Wow, guys, so townhomes often are three levels. You have something on the main level, including here you have a two-car garage. Then you have your main everyday living space right here. You've got a terrace, a beautiful kitchen with nice, beautiful gray. I'm just, what, what else can I say besides beautiful? And then you've got 42 inch cabinets with crown molding there. If you're a subscriber, you know I do like to shoot from the sink looking out. If you're not, hit that button. So in a typical townhome, you maybe have a room like that bedroom on the main level with a bath, two car garage. You come to this level, it's your everyday living space, your great room. Now there is of course a powder room on this level, so you're not running up and down the stairs to use the restroom. You have it basically right here. And you have this great looking space, line of sight from the front to the back. And we'll go upstairs where the bedrooms are, show you how cool that primary suite is. But guys, the way it works in our world is you wanna call me first, never reach out to the builder. Look at the mature trees. Wow, you don't usually see trees that mature in a new construction development, but think about it, this is an established development and just conveniently located right off of I-77. You've got Kingsley, Caddy Cornered, all the things about Baxter Village from restaurants to wine bars uh, that we love. And then once you uh, go Caddy Cornered, you've got some tremendous restaurants and opportunities over at Kingsley and the whole place is under development. Then you're just right down the road from the actual downtown of Fort Mill, which has its own personality. Everything from festivals, strawberry festivals, to, uh, wow, cool little downtown block. Make sure you eat at Hobo's. So you've got two uh, bedrooms up here on this end. And again, you're looking out at that park, which you would be spending time over there with the dog, with the kiddos, with yourself, sitting on those benches and enjoying really some nice outdoor amenities, but hey, there, there are more amenities than that here in Baxter. You will be involved with other things. And so we'll tell you all about it, but you'll have access to the Baxter Village amenities for sure. Good size closet. We do have carpet in the bedrooms. These three, now see how large that bench is? When Jack the real estate dog was alive, I would have sat him up on that bench and tried to give him a, sh a bath. He would have liked that. Oh man, this is great living. And really to put it all in perspective, 
to, to be able to get into a new construction townhome, especially with Fort Mill schools, think about that. And to be in this price point, it's a great way to go if you can do it. And it's walkable into Baxter Village, Starbucks, all kind of stuff, restaurants, wine bar. And then you're, again, catty cornered over to uh, Kingsley. But think about this. You're right up 77 into Charlotte because Baxter is right off of I-77, which runs north and south through the greater Charlotte area. Guys, we'd love to help you with this. If you need to list and sell your home, call me about that. But let me connect you to one of my team. Never reach out to this builder or any builder without knowing who your buyer agent is. And I can connect you to one of my team and we can make that happen before, before these get scooped up. All right, guys, I'd love to help you. 704-345-3400. On location, Baxter Village Towns. My number is 704-345-3400. And I'll see you in the next video. Go to rajahollowayhomes.com.